Hunt Palmer here for BayouBengalsInsider.com and Louisiana Daily. Week two of LSU football season, a little bit of a return to normalcy. Beautiful weather here in Baton Rouge, no impending storms as the Tigers step out of conference once again to take on the Washington Huskies. A little bit of a step up in competition this week. Washington, an offense that can really score some points and a great quarterback in Keith Price. That's something LSU is going to have to keep an eye on. They did a nice job against North Texas except for two blown coverages. Washington's going to come in. They're going to throw the football quite a lot. Steve Sharkeesian's a great player caller and expect those guys to try to put some points up through the air. Not a great ground team. LSU does a great job of stopping the run, so that shouldn't be a factor. Offensively for LSU, there are still some questions to be answered. Will Zach Mettenberger stretch the field a little bit? Will he even have to? Washington's a team that struggles to stop the run. If you go back to the Alamo Bowl last year against Baylor, three separate Baylor running backs, not Robert Griffin, Three running backs ran for over 100 yards in that football game, and just last week, San Jose State was able to run for 200 yards against this Washington front. LSU's going to hand the ball off to Kenny Hilliard, now for Blue, give some touches to Michael Ford, and they should be able to wear out this Washington defense and keep the ball away from the potent offense and Keith Price. This is a game that could get a little bit interesting. Probably not, though, if LSU's able to churn it out on the ground and get out of this thing with a victory, head on to week three when Idaho comes to town. Reporting for Bayou Bengals Insider.com, Common Louisiana Daily, I'm Hunt Palmer.